Welcome to SmackDown Live, where hopefully we're about to get some sort of clarification from Brooklyn Von Braun on last week's shocking turn of events. I am a big fan of movies. Mostly the ones I've starred in, but there are some other ones that are okay too. But in any film, my favorite part is always near the end when the villain explains their big evil plan going over every single detail of how they pulled the wool over the stupid idiot hero's eyes. But in movies, this usually allows the hero time to escape or stop the bad guy in some way. But I'm not gonna be stopped. See, I already destroyed your idiot hero last week with the help of Samoa Joe. So now, I have all the time in the world to walk you through every single detail of my brilliant scheme. Like I said, this is my favorite part. So here we go. When I was GM, I brought Samoa Joe back fully knowing what his plans were for attacking Trey in the best of five final and costing Red her title. In fact, I helped make those plans myself. Then, I gave Trey a title match against Adam Cole just so Joe could eventually take it from Trey. Sorry, Adam. After that, I inserted myself into the mixed match challenge as Trey's partner to earn his trust, giving me the opportunity to teach him the secret Coquina Clutch escape. Only when Joe got it on Trey, and he thought he had it all under control, those ankles weren't crossed, were they? because it wasn't a secret anymore. I told Joe exactly what to expect, and Trey never had a chance. <laughs> now, unfortunately, to make Trey and Red think I had changed for the better, I did have to donate a bunch of money to an animal shelter. But don't worry. I purchased the shelter, kicked out all the disgusting animals, and I'm turning it into the newest location for my tanning salon chain, Brooklyn Von Brown. Which, if you ask me, is a lot more to serve the community. So right about now, your tiny brains are probably asking, but why, Brooklyn? Why would you do all of this? I did this to maintain the hierarchy to show Red and Trey that despite what they think they've achieved in WWE, I'm the star and they're the losers, just like it's always been. And that will never change. Anyway, I've spent way too much time talking about those rejects, so let's discuss what's next for the American hero, new trademark lawsuit pending. Well, I have some big news to share. I'm a champion. You see, I recently talked to WWE management about bringing back a title from the past, and they agreed I was the perfect superstar to award it to. So I'd like to present to you, your new WWE Divas Champion, me! You've got to be kidding me. I guess this explains why I was told to inform Red that the Divas Championship was already spoken for. You know, maybe in the future, Trey, you should be a little more careful about who sees your phone. You never know what they could find on there. Like maybe even a copy of a list outlining all their friends' dreams and ambitions. Clearly, Red has heard and seen enough. Well, she should be mad at her friend Trey for letting all this happen. Let's go, right now, you and me. I'm a prize fighter, and considering I've got the prize, I decide when I fight, so run along. Maybe there's something else you can cross off your list, like find someone who will take me out on a date, or fix my jacked up teeth. Those are real things on her list. I saw it. I'm coming for you and that title. Look out! This is getting out of hand. You wanted this? Well, now you got it. Thankfully, Trey is here to put an end to this. It's Samoa Joe. Where did he come from? It's obvious Brooklyn and Samoa Joe are always two steps ahead of Red and Trey.
And now Brooklyn is going to force Red to watch her best friend get destroyed by Samoa Joe yet again. He's suffered enough. Come on, don't do it. No. Trey might be seriously injured. This, this is bad. Well, Trey's condition's unclear. One thing is, the duo of Brooklyn Von Braun and Samoa Joe will annihilate anyone who attempts to get in their way. So what's the verdict? Nothing too serious. I'll just be out a couple weeks. You're lucky. That could have ended your career. It would take a much worse attack than that to end my career. Or being offered the hosting gig on America's Next Top Hand Model, which is the best show on TV, hands down. See? I'm a natural. So, are you mad that Brooklyn saw the list on my phone? I was, but I think I'm over it, considering you almost got snapped in half trying to help me. Besides, I just found out next week I have a number one contenders match for the Divas Championship. So I'm still gonna cross it off the list. Good. At least one of us will be in the title picture. What do you mean? Aren't you gonna use your rematch clause when you heal up? I would if I had one. Turns out one of the other loose ends Brooklyn took care of before she stepped down as GM was removing the rematch clause from my contract. So if I want another shot at Samoa Joe, I'm gonna have to earn it just like anyone else. I know you can do it. But first, you need to focus on getting better. I guess it's just like on America's Next Top Hand model when Andrea jammed her finger playing volleyball and lost the Christmas engagement ring campaign. It took a lot of hard work and moisturizing, but in a couple months her hand was back in top form and she booked the Valentine's Day spot, which was way bigger than the Christmas gig. I must have missed that episode. I can get you a copy. I have every one of them saved. I think I got the gist of it. Your loss. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making her way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, Ray. Cho, the Saint. A big time fatal four-way match coming up here, guys. Which means, believe it or not, we're going to be sending away three of these superstars with a loss here tonight. Guys, I don't recall the last time I saw these women more focused than they look right now. It's a big match, Cole. To expect anything less from these women here tonight would be just plain silly. And here comes Sasha and her opponents. First, from Boston, Massachusetts, Sasha Banks. Byron, it's always a treat to see Sasha Banks. Sasha Banks has her own swag. She's got her own confidence, and she knows how to back it up. If there's a camera around, Sasha wants to be in front of it. If there's a spotlight out, she wants to be in the middle of it. Sasha Banks once stood in line for the opening of a refrigerator. Give you this. She agrees with my philosophy that there are no friendships in this business. Oh, come on, Cole. Sasha Banks has had plenty of friendships. Yeah, they flourished just as long as Banks needed them to. Oh, 
I wish he'd just stop. Don't let the appearance fool you. Dakota Kai will kick your face clean off your head. And from Auckland, New Zealand, Dakota Kai. You know what I love about Dakota Kai is that she's such an incredibly humble competitor, but then you see her in the ring and you can't help but become a huge fan of the passion and fire she has when she competes. As much as I hate to agree with you, Byron, Dakota Kai is the kind of girl that will disarm you with a smile and then kick the features clean off your face. And many idols that she looked up to in sports entertainment, including one of her favorites, Finn Balor. And many idols that she looked up to in sports entertainment, including one of her favorites, Finn Balor. The irresistible force. And from San Diego, California, Nia Jax. One of the most dominant women in WWE history. Physically unparalleled in the women's division, Nia Jax has imposed her will on everyone that stepped in the ring as opposition. An incredible pedigree for success for Nia Jax. That is a woman who looks like she owns the ring. Been so impressed with what this young lady has accomplished in such a short time. Her eyes will lure you in, but her style will destroy you. If you're just joining us on SmackDown Live, this fatal four-way match will determine the number one contender for Brooklyn Von Braun's WWE Divas Championship. Yes, you heard that correctly. Brooklyn petitioned WWE officials to bring the Divas Championship out of retirement and award it to her, simply out of spite towards Red. The Divas Championship actually holds a lot of personal meaning for Red, and it was one of the final milestones she wanted to cross off her list. You two are acting like Red's been barred from ever holding the Divas Championship. She still has that opportunity if she can win this match and then defeat Brooklyn Von Braun. Striking combination. Oh, and that well scouted. There she goes. To the outside. No, another reversal. Neither one of them are willing to give an inch here. Good night. Good grief. She says, no thanks. Going after the neck area. Guys, I don't know how much more that she can take. Cuts going for the head here. That's one you feel for a few days, Cole. Great athleticism from Banks. Nice head scissors. Incredible. There was a lot of force behind that one. Set up for the beautiful side Russian leg sweep. Well, it's not really my thing, but the crowd is loving Sasha's act. Things not going her way. Her head's got to be pumped. That'll absolutely give you a head. Going after the neck area. Going after the neck area. Got focusing on the head here. Tough position to be in for sure. Going after the neck area. Another attack above the shoulder. Going after the neck area. Guys, I don't know how much more that she can take. Anticipated that attack perfectly. Producing a trampling. Here she goes, back in the ring now. Oh, the dreaded claw to the oh, shoulder. man. Nia Jax able to avoid damage there. Up and around. Oh, man, spine-crushing impact. Uh-oh. Ouch. What an elbow drop. Things not going her way. Her head's got to be pounding right about now, Cole. That'll absolutely give you a headache. That's for sure, Michael. Oh, she turns up. What does Dakota Kai have in store? 
Backstabber! Ouch! What a great move. Oh, man, Nia Jax doesn't even know where she is. Maybe not to the neck area. Guys, I don't know how much more that she can take. Targeting the stomach. And no luck against Nia Jax there. Good, Good, buster. Buster. Good way to fracture a rim. Focusing on the head here. Tough position to be in for sure. Going after the neck area. Guys, I don't know how much more that she can take. Ooh, right to the throat. We're about to see. Russian leg sweep. Nothing fancy here. Another attack above the shoulders. So devastating. Oh man, good time. Just barely. Things not going her way. Her head's got to be pounding right about now, Cole. Taking the attack above the shoulders yet again. Man, that'll make your head hurt. Vicious kick, Sasha striking right to the kidney. Things not going her way. Her head's got to be pounding right up. That'll absolutely give you a headache. That's for sure, Michael. Things not going her way. Her Can she do it here? The pen's broken up. This is not going to end well for Sasha Banks. Dakota Kai able to counter beautifully. She's got her. Oh, man, check out. The shoulders are down. Now back to the ring. She saw the opening and got the shoulder up. One kick. Uh-oh. Down across the knee. Heat sinking missile. Bad news for the boss. And the odds just swung in Dakota Kai's favor. Nice. This could be big. Taking the attack above the shoulders yet again. Man, that'll make your head hurt. Going after the neck area. Guys, I don't know how much more that she can take. Another attack. Things not going her way. Her head's got to be pounding right about now, Cole. She's looking a bit out of it here. Body shots over and over. One to the jaw and then... Ouch. Whoa! Now I can feel. Interesting there. Nia Jax is in trouble. Slide driver! You know what they call that? Something no one would ever do to me. Uh-oh! Harsh impact. Oh, look at Look at this! Backbreaker! Thought up with a... Kick to the gun. Uh-oh! He's gonna try it again.
There's no doubt about it. That's a big pinfall win right there. I knew she was going to win the whole time, Michael. And it's matches like this one that make SmackDown such a success. Thank you so much for joining us. At the Royal Rumble, the WWE Universe will witness a night of firsts. It'll be the first time the WWE Divas Championship has been defended in nearly 15 years. And it'll be the first time these two longtime rivals step inside the ring and face each other in a one-on-one -on -one match. So ladies, all that's left is to sign the contract and make this unprecedented night official. Byron, as former GM of SmackDown Live, I conducted quite a few contract signings. And let me just say, you're doing a terrible job. You didn't even give me a chance to embarrass my opponent. Sorry. Now, Byron mentioned this is going to be the first official match between Red and I. But we've had our share of fights over the years. So I wanted to take the WWE Universe back to when Red and I were in high school to see actual footage from our very first fight. Well, it was really more of a one-sided beatdown. This is what happens when you mess with the captain of the wrestling team. What are you gonna do? Hit me with a steel chair? Put me through a table? I'm going to get help. <laughs> introduce you to her best friend, Trey. Get it? Because he busted his butt on a lunch tray. <laughs> Trey, 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 Trey. Oh. Now her face matches her nickname. Hot head red. Hot head red. Hot head red. <laughs> At the Royal Rumble, our next fight is going to end just like they always have. You on the ground, screaming in pain, tapping out to the biggest crossover star in WWE history, the American hero, Brooklyn Von Braun! You know, I heard a rumor that you were going to show that footage tonight. So with that in mind, I actually got a gift for you. <laughs> That's cute, but I don't put that high fructose trash in my finely tuned body. It's not going in your body, it's going on your body. Of course Hothead Red loses her temper. Red's going to get revenge for their high school encounter. Not if Brooklyn has anything to say about it. The old cell phone video didn't do it justice. It's even better in person all these years later. Brooklyn may have won up red again here tonight, but these two lifelong rivals will finally settle their differences once and for all at the Royal Rumble. So what number did you get for the Royal Rumble match? Two. Oh, well, that's a really tough draw, but I'm sure lots of people have won from that spot. Wait, is that piece of paper with your number on it folded in half? Oh, yeah, it is. It's not two, it's 23. Okay, now I like your chances a little better. Not that I was doubting you before. <laughs> Look, after I win the Rumble, I can't wait to watch you put Brooklyn in her place once and for all. She may have gotten the better of me in the past, but tonight's different. She has to step into my ring. Yeah. My only concern is she might pull something cheap, like having Samoa Joe get involved. I'll make sure that doesn't happen. By the way, have you seen Sin Cara? I think I owe him an apology. Why? When I thought I drew number two, I may have thrown a slight tantrum and damaged his mini trampoline. I'm not sure he even knows how to get into the ring without that. I think he'll manage for one night. Besides, we have bigger things to worry about. Okay. 
I wrote a special song for the Royal Rumble. Want to hear it? Not really. Well, I'm going to play it anyway. Well, I've been searching all these years for a sign to show me the way. But it was right in front of me and he went by the name of Trey. You see, this man's been lucky his entire stupid career. So I knew if he could succeed, I had nothing to fear. Tonight I outlast 29 men so I can get my shot at the gold. And then the universe walks with Elias in the greatest tale ever told. So what do you think? I think you're going to have to rewrite your song after tonight. Guys, Tyler Breeze has been unsuccessfully trying to eliminate Otis for quite a while now. He's going to need a lot more stakes and lift a lot more weights if he wants to throw Otis over the top rope. Adam Cole from behind, and he eliminates both of them. And now Adam Cole is all alone in the ring, giving him a chance to catch his breath before the next superstar enters. Here we go. Who is it going to be? His trampoline exploded. Is he okay? Considering he just hit the apron and rib first at full speed, I'm gonna go with no. Unfortunately, it looks like Sin Cara will not be able to compete in the Royal Rumble match. I guess we're moving on to our next entrance. It's Trey. Adam Cole can't wait to get his hands on him. Sorry, man. That's that's on me. These two certainly have some unfinished business as Trey defeated Adam Cole for the WWE Championship thanks to Samoa Joe's interference. From the many, one will rise from this time-tested arena, a place where countless warriors have sought glory, but only few achieved it. No question, Michael. One superstar's immortality awaits, but many Adam other Cole competitors stand in the way. Been there is nothing like a Royal Rumble match. It's matches like this that you really see how differently a WWE superstar's head is wired. It's a tough match to win no matter when you enter. Take it from me, Corey, someone who's actually been in the Royal Rumble. We rarely see the final entrant win the Rumble because it takes dedication to stay composed as the final eliminations occur. It's like starting an inning on third base. There's no guarantee you'll cross home plate, but all the pressure in the world. Looks like we might get an elimination, guys. And what a reversal from Seth Rollins. Rollins, so impressive. Uh, Seth Rollins made him pay with the counter there. Rollins is so smart inside that ring. Ooh, brutal body shot. Looking for the elimination. He's got it right where he wants it. Look who's coming now, guys. This could be a game changer, Michael. Oh, man. Ouch. Oh, what a counter. And again, yet another counter. know that's just a sample of what he can do who's it gonna be there he goes crashing to the floor. ladies and gentlemen Elias has been eliminated heavy duty right hand showing a lot of fury with these attacks he's looking relentless lightning fast reflexes an impressive series of moves looks like nobody's budging Cole This has got trouble written all over it, guys. For my money, guys, there's no greater Royal Rumble competitor than Stone Cold Steve Austin. The man simply dominated nearly every Rumble he competed in. Oh, and you can tell he's got evil intentions on his mind. In a match like this, you have to, Michael. Had it scouted. 
he knew that was coming. He just punched him in the chest. Big punch finds its mark. Spine Buster with a sit out. Nasty. Straight punch, nothing fancy. Who's this gonna be? Whoa, the team dream has been eliminated. eliminated. Talk about not being prepared. Oh man, what a boot! Uh oh, this will shake things up. You're not kidding, Michael. As Corey mentioned, Stone Cold certainly has an impressive Royal Rumble resume. And it'd be even more impressive if he was able to hold on and win the 1999 Rumble match. Michael, I'm still miffed about that one. Mr. McMahon literally stole the victory out from underneath Austin. We're about to find out who enters next. Right in the jaw. Ugh, what a shot. Oh, Corey, he unloaded there. Possible elimination, Corey. More like a definite elimination, if you ask me. Could very well get dumped out here. Oh, right to the throat. There's a big reversal by Seth Rollins. How good is Seth Rollins? Oh, hello. Oh, able to counter. Impact. He's the biggest nerd you've ever seen. I guess you don't have any mirrors in your house, do you? Not again. One of these competitors is eventually going to have to gain the upper hand. Oh, no! Wow, what a lariat! Now watch this! Northern Lights! Setting up. A beautiful counter courtesy of Seth Rollins. Ricky Dave Dave. has been eliminated. Good offense here from Seth Rollins. Innovation from the Kingslayer. Oh, huge the elimination. New Daniel right there. Bryan has been eliminated. Saw what he had in mind there. Caught with a big boot. On the mark. Oh, nasty impact. Kevin Owens has been eliminated. Seth Rollins gets out of trouble and quickly. This guy has what it takes to make major impact here. Yeah, Seth yet it's Rollins been, has he's been, been eliminated. He's won the Royal Rumble and will now go on to fight for a championship at WrestleMania. Wait, wait a second. Why is the countdown clock starting up again? The, the Rumble's over. Apparently, there's another entrant. <laughs> Hold on, it can't be. Is that who I think it is? No way. It's the President of the United States of America. President Rock is in the Royal Rumble. This is unbelievable. We all thought the match was over, but I guess there are 31 entrants this year. It's the President. He can do whatever he wants. We're all witnessing history for the first time ever. The president is competing in the Royal Rumble. And Trey has to beat him to go to WrestleMania. Over the years, there have been numerous surprise entrants in the Royal Rumble, from returning superstars to legends and even celebrities. But none of them were bigger than this. Surprise factor aside, what can we expect to see from President Rock tonight? I mean, as of late, all of his fiercest opponents have been of the political variety in Washington. What kind of fighting shape is he in? Just look at him. I don't think he's missed a workout the entire time he's been in the Oval Office. In fact, I heard half of Air Force One has been converted into the top-of-the-line gym. And don't forget, Trey's already been in the Rumble for a while. The president's completely rested. You two may be right, but we're about to find out 
if our Commander-in-Chief has what it takes to win the Royal Rumble. Devastating elbow. Showing no signs of defense here, guys. He's fighting hard, and it's paying off. Nothing is going to stop him now. Big boot. Oh, foot just stomping down. Uh-oh, look oh, at this. Nelson applies. Dragon suplex. He's stuck in the corner now. Here we go, guys. Elimination coming up. Byron, have you ever been in a rumble? Oh, in my dreams. I have. Waist lock. No, no. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. Nice right hand. Punch right to the face. Barring any more surprises this time, it's official. Trey has won the Royal Rumble and will compete for a title at WrestleMania. I still can't believe what we just witnessed. This is going to make headlines all around the world. It looks like the president's not finished with Trey. Trey has earned the president's seal of approval. Maybe he's in line for a cabinet position. Let's not get carried away, Saxton. He should at least get an invite to the White House. You've known the president for a long time, Cole. You've been to the White House yet? No, but he's a busy guy. I'm sure he'll get around to inviting me. Anyway, congratulations again to Trey on this history-making night. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. And he's for the WWE Divas Championship. Ladies and gentlemen, as a reminder, the championship is on the line here tonight. And in looking at the opposition, I can say that the champion will have quite the hill to climb in this one. A big opportunity for her here, Corey, as the gold could be going home with her tonight. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say that tonight is the night we crown a new champion. That's how impressed I've been by her of late. It's the American hero, Brooklyn Von Braun. As a reminder, the title is on the line here in this match. And the champ is certainly going to have an uphill battle, that's for sure.
Introducing the challenger from Chicago, Illinois, Ray Cho, the Saint. And introducing the champion, she is the WWE Divas Champion, Brooklyn Vaughn Braun! The historic Divas title may have a new owner tonight. The match with nearly two decades of buildup has finally made it to a WWE ring. It's Red versus Brooklyn Von Braun. Until recently, I would have thought Red had the advantage with Brooklyn Von Braun stepping onto her turf. But Brooklyn's transition from MMA to WWE has been virtually seamless. Yeah, it's very similar to how quickly Ronda Rousey was able to get acclimated in WWE. With that being said, tonight's outcome is extremely difficult to predict, as this might be one of the most personal conflicts we've ever witnessed. Now, oh, trampling the opposition. Attack to the midsection. the mouth oh, relentless God. enough already nothing's gonna stop her now she's executing on her plan perfectly what a punch gets out of dodge there red and brooklyn are going back and forth taking out years of frustration on each other looks like red's got the upper hand for now red with the tackle and now both women are down. So far, these two have been matching each other move for move. One of them needs to somehow gain an inch. And there you see Samoa Joe watching this heated battle. I think he's headed out here to provide that edge Brooklyn needs. Trey nails him from behind. He was ready to stop him. And they're ready to go in the backstage area. Oh, oh right to the back. Whack. Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Just a step quicker. Reversal. What a counter. Something big is coming. Backdrop suplex. Wow, what impact. Boom. Oh, what an uppercut. Jarring. Wicked chop. Power bomb. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Hits him with a gut wrench suplex. What impact. Bot uppercut. That'll cost some teeth. He might have been waiting on that one. Ooh. That is a great reversal. Boom! Launched with a belly to belly. 
Oh, oh what a right! Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. There's number one. I think we know what Joe's looking for. Another? Man, oh man. Incredible. He got out of the way. Boom, <laughs> running STO plants him. Nicely done. And no luck against Joe there. Uh-uh. Wrench in the arm. Not done yet. Into the arm breaker. Hammerlock. Boom. Boom. Oh, what impact. Oh, and that's the second time. You don't want to get hit with that once, let alone Boom. twice. Great reflexes. Whoa, it's another reversal. Ooh. How impressive was that reversal? Oh, look at this. What's he going to do here? Samoa Joe could be thinking about... There it is. to the kidneys. Golly. Boom. And no luck against Joe there. Uh-uh. Great reversal. I gotta say, I'm impressed. What's he gonna do here? Samoa Joe could be thinking about... There it is. Point of the elbow, nail. Looking to end this. Trey manages to get Samoa Joe down, but for how long? Wait, what's Trey doing? I think he's going to put Joe inside the trunk of that car. He's going to try to. Joe's dead weight. Well, that's one way to stop Samoa Joe from interfering. Yeah, assuming that trunk is strong enough to contain Joe and his enhanced arm. It looks like it'll do the job, for now at least. Red and Brooklyn are finally recovering after we cut away to see what was happening backstage between Trey and Samoa Joe. I'm just glad that thanks to Trey, we're gonna get a definitive win in this match. Yeah, as long as one of them can make it back in the ring before the 10 count. And they both do. Neither of them are ready for this match to end. For nearly a decade, the Divas title was the pinnacle for women's wrestling. And it's back up for grabs tonight. Now, Michael, you and I were there to call a final defense of this title at Roadblock in 2016. And I am excited to call it again right here tonight. Oh, what a right! Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. Wow, she turned that one around. Oof, kick finds it. Narrowly avoiding trouble. Yeah, that could have been bad. Oh, what a close line. She's clearly not getting paid by the hour. And she kicks out with relative ease. It's going to take more than that. She scores big with the counter. Breaker. Ow! Oh, targeting the stomach. Right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Gosh. Enough already. What a punch! Whoa, right hand of the body. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper 
extend your elbow. Great athleticism. She steers clear there. And now that one's countered. Ooh. Saw that one coming. Slam. What a shot. Hammer lock. Uh oh, uh oh. Elusive movement there. Looking stunned here, guys. Ooh, right to the throat. She's got her where she wants her. Oh, could this be it? Oh, nice. Now's the time to capitalize. That just echoed throughout this entire arena. Got the cross face applied. She's got her where she... She works her way out of that one. She's still got a bit of an uphill climb here, though. A uh, snap man. Knee smash. Not what she was looking for. No, another reversal. Neither one of them are willing to give an inch here. Reversed. Hey, I'm picking up steam here. This is incredible. Absolute. Nope, nope, and nope. Top of the slam. We might be close to the end. She's tough, but maybe not tough enough to get the win here. The size of this girl's heart is simply immeasurable. She's got that gleam in her eyes. He's going to try again. How many times does that end a match? A and this is going to be it. <laughs> near fall after near fall in this matchup here. Right now, I just don't know what it's going to take. Gotta be careful not to get counted out here. End of days. Incredible. for years, but she's also achieved a childhood dream in capturing the WWE Divas Championship. This has to feel like a giant weight has been lifted off of Red in so many ways. And here comes Red's best friend to join in the celebration. Respect to Red for being able to achieve the seemingly impossible. This is truly a special night for her, both personally and professionally. <laughs> 